Good afternoon, Blue Raider fans. Josh Vardman and Jessica Watts here as we begin week three of Middle Tennessee football camp. The Blue Raiders are trying to implement more of a game plan this week as they get ready for Vanderbilt on the season opener on September 2nd when the Commodores make the short jaunt down from Nashville down here to Murfreesboro to play in Floyd Stadium. On Saturday, the Blue Raiders had their first scrimmage of the season where the offense looked explosive as always and the defense is starting to show vast improvements through the first two weeks of camp thanks to new defensive coordinator Scott Schaefer. And the main area where the Blue Raiders have shown a lot of improvement through two weeks is in their tackling ability. Last year, the Blue Raiders gave up a lot of big plays because of missed tackling opportunities. This year, Schaefer is trying to get them to play more aggressively, more downhill, and trying to get them to tackle with more of a fundamental philosophy. Yes, the defense was led by Mizzou transfer Walter Brady and DJ Sanders, where they both recorded tackles for loss, and the defense also recovered a fumble, and head coach Rick Stockstill also noted that the defense only missed two tackles that he saw. Now something else to keep in mind, Blue Raider fans, this week as we get in later into the week on Saturday, they'll hold their second scrimmage of the season, and then the day after that on Sunday, come on down to Floyd Stadium where it'll be fan day. You can bring your pens, pencils, something to sign. The football team, the volleyball team, the women's soccer team will all be around, and you can even get football season tickets at gate three. And make sure to stick around after fan day. The women's soccer team will be playing at 6 p.m. versus Austin P. And from everyone here with Blue Raider Athletics, thank you for joining us. And make sure to stay right here at GoBlueRaiders.com for all of your Blue Raider coverage.